What is up everyone this is Kiran here welcome back to Tech Kiran YouTube channel ne Zuko OS which is based on Android version 11 with the latest security patch of 5th of March 2021 and which includes the Optimus Drunk Surya and this is the kernel which we get pre installed I have installed it on my Redmi Note ne sorry Poco X3 actually and I am using it from some time it includes some bit of features but not that much advanced features but still it's kind of a good custom room let's take a look at this nezuko os which is an unofficial build i have installed some apps here as you can see i have installed many kind of apps which i use on my device as my daily usage and it has this rounded ui which is one of my favorite one includes this data usage styles we have the vorti icon so all the basic things are available the bluetooth etc seems to be working as you can see i have tried to connect my smart device here which is working perfectly fine the things which you can customize the header styles and some things like that including that if we talk about the default launcher we have the pixel launcher pre installed it comes with the google pixel google apps actually pre installed so yes it has the google pixel launcher pre installed version 11 as you can see it comes with the pixel launcher i was looking for some other launchers because now rooms are coming with many other launchers and with some extra features but it includes a screenshot and select option in the pixel launcher so yes these are some interesting kind of things which you get here if the select option is perfectly working fine i have tried it as you can see let me share with you you can simply select any text from this recent screen and you can simply search it on the google or internet any any kind of browser so some interesting features are available which i liked about this build the performance is up to the mark which is one of the great highlights of this build camera go is available and the gcam 8.1 is working perfectly fine also i try to use the portrait mode i try to use the camera mode video mode etc in the video mode you can simply record the videos up to 4k 60 fps but the 4k 60 fps is not working for all the devices 4k 30 fps is working and 1080p 60 fps both of the things are perfectly working fine i personally use video recording a lot so that's why i just wanted to let you know if you talk about some other things about this nizuko os which you get here it has all those google apps available which means all the pixel apps which you get pre installed and also one of the best thing is if you go in the play store let me share with you by going into settings options we have the play protect certification is device is certified so as yes, i'll be able to use banking apps without any kind of issues you simply need to go to the magisk manager app if the safenet status is not passing for you as in my case it is passing without without any issues but still if it is not passing for you what you can do is you can simply install a magisk module for that as you can see i have installed some interesting kind of magisk modules which includes the fonts file which includes the gestures file and the magisk hide props config these are some interesting kind of things i have tried to enable that full screen gestures module because there was a pill there which i didn't like much so that's why i'm using that module and this feature is not available in this room this feature should be available there but unfortunately it's not available this is a thing which you need to keep in mind if you want to but is when alternative available like the magisk module there might not be a big issue it includes very interesting kind of ui in settings like the nizuko extras and nizuko health which is very interesting kind of thing which shows you the covid-19 data in india which is very interesting kind of thing you can simply search for it and it is updating regularly including that we have the nizuko extras where we have many kind of options available we can customize your device lock screen settings fingerprint related customizations lock screen related customizations of course and including that we have the status bar related customizations but in status bar and wherever you go will not see much kind of customizations there are many kind of custom rooms available which has more customizations than this one but still it doesn't have those much less customization you can simply use this build on a device without any kind of issues some basic features are available some basic features are not available so there might be some mixed opinions about this build nizuko os i thought might be a greatest one but unfortunately this is not one of the greatest custom rooms but still it's okay okay to try it out on your device it has some interesting kind of fonts where we have my favorite fonts google sans which i personally use on my device it doesn't even include the status bar icons customizations which i was looking for but unfortunately i didn't found that these are some interesting things we have the face lock and etc security related things doesn't include the app locker which i was looking for but still it's not available some interesting things i've already shared with you 
these were the things i just want to let you know and i hope you like this link for this build is in the description for the poco x3 users you can install this rom and reboot thanks for watching and goodbye have a nice day